now the top connection. So the next connection is the yellow cable. Once again, there are arrows here. You just want to line those up. Does it show the arrows? Or? Yeah, but it's not white anymore. Oh my goodness. So just one push, that's it. And these will connect to the expiratory lens to heat it up. And as you can see, this one has three, three holes. This one has two. So basically, you can't really fail with that. So this one has three prongs, this one has three prongs, you just want to line it up, and it goes right in. This one on the expiratory, there are two prongs, two prongs, you just want to line that up. Oh, you'll have to finish. <laughs> <laughs> you'll do it today, you'll do it next week, you'll do it to review for your checkoff, you do it during your checkoff, in your second year you do it, and then in the hospitals. So, so that second is going to just uh, measure the temperature of exhaled air? No, no, these are heater cables. They're going to heat up the circuit. So that'll mm -hmm. prevent that air from cooling. Because if it cools, it's going to create mm -hmm. condensation. There's going to be water in the circuit. Yeah, without heating up the actual circuit, as the air travels through the circuit, it cools down. And cooler air is not going to hang on to water, and the water is going to condense. So you would have a lot of water slushing in the tubing. So by keeping the, the tubing warm, that water vapor will stay in the flow of gas. So that's the reason for it. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then it tells you to turn on the humidifier. Uh, on off button, you want to press that. And you want this to be on invasive, because that's going into the patient. It's already selected, you see the light. So the temperature says 23 right now. With it plugged in, it's going to go up to 39. So we need to preset this before we set it up for the patient. We can't set this up, you understand? Because it needs to warm up and stuff, right? Yeah, but sometimes if, they're, if the ventilator's on the patient, they have an HME, and now you're going to switch from the HME to a heated humidifier, they're already there. So yeah, you go ahead and put it on. It just takes maybe 10 minutes until yeah, it, it reaches temperature. Okay. So you selected invasive mode. Why would you select non-invasive mode? Mm. Why non. would you select non-invasive mm. mode? Since they if they were wearing a mask? Yes. So you, you can do BiPAP through the ventilators now. Um, so that's just a mask. That's not an endotracheal tube. Mm. Invasive is for endotube or tracheostomy. Non-invasive is for a mask. Very good. Uh, can you figure out the alarm silence on the front of that panel? Mm -hmm. um, what about the digital readout where the water temperature is, displ is displayed? Yes. Okay, that's all it tells you. 